Hello students. In the last class we did question number 1 to 4. Word problems. Today we will be doing the remaining ones. Okay. Let's see first question. Question number 5. So it gives 1 by 5 of a chocolate bar to Alan and 3 by 8 of it to Meenakshi. What fraction of chocolate is left with Suman? How many chocolates Suman had? He had only a chocolate. He had only one chocolate. And what he did from that, from that chocolate, he gave 1 by 5 to Anand. Okay? And 3 by 5 of the same chocolate, he gave to Meenakshi. Okay? From the same chocolate bar only, he gave one portion to Anand and one portion to Meenakshi. Now, question is how much of the chocolate or what fraction of the chocolate is left with him, remaining with him. How to find out? We have to subtract the fraction of chocolate gave to Anand and Meenakshi from what chocolate he had with him? What is that? One chocolate. One chocolate bar he had with him. From that we have to subtract what is given to Anand and Meenakshi. Okay? The same time, question number 4 or you know, question number 3 I think what we did. The same type of question only we can see. Then what is the first statement? First statement will be what is 1 by 5? is that? 1 by 5. 1 by 5 is the fraction of chocolate given to Anand. What is 1 by 5? Fraction of chocolate given to Anand. It's not the number of chocolates given to him because from one chocolate only, one portion only is given to him. Then fraction of chocolate given to Anand. What is 3 by 8? Fraction of chocolate given to Minakshi. Now, what you are going to find out, what fraction of chocolate is left with Suman? Then one answer we are going to find out is, fraction of chocolate left with, left with Suman. How can we find out what chocolate he had? One chocolate he had. Minus chocolates given to or fraction of chocolate given to Anand and Minakshi. 3 by 8. Okay, from 1 we have to subtract what is given to Anand then Minakshi. Instead of subtract, subtracting them one by one, we are subtracting them together. Okay, now one, what to do? Write 1 by 1 minus 1 by 5 plus 3 by 8. Now what to do? Find the LCM. Denominators are different now. All the rules of subtraction of fractions we have to follow. 1, 5, 8. LCM of 1, 5 and 8 will be 40. Now what to do? We have to see how many ones are 40. 140 is are 40. Then multiply the numerator also with the same 40 minus sign. Next in the bracket, how many 5s are 40? 5 8s are 40. Multiply numerator also with the same 8 plus how many 8s are 40? 8 5s are 40. 3 multiplied by 5. The same way we have to continue the full process and find out what fraction of chocolate is left with Suman. Okay? Now, we can see the next question. For a party, 7 1 by 5 kilograms of vegetables were used. Total how much vegetables are used? 7 1 by 5 kilograms of vegetables. 7, 1 by 5 kilogram of vegetables. It consisted of, means the 7, 1 by 5 kilogram of vegetables consisted of, what all things we can see? 2, 3 by 8 kilograms of potatoes. 2, 3 by 8 kilograms of potatoes. And 3, 1 by 4 kilograms of 
of onions. Three one by four kilograms of onions and some tomatoes. How much tomatoes? That is not given. And some tomatoes. How much tomatoes? Or how many kilograms of tomatoes were used? That is not given. Now, how many kilograms of tomatoes were used? Our question is to find out how many kilograms of tomatoes were used. This is a question mark for us because we don't know. How can you find out? Very easy. The same type of question. Here, now you need to guess how much is there. Very clearly given. Total weight of all these three vegetables is seven one by five. Kg. Then in that the weight of two items is given and the third item's weight. How to find out? For finding out that from the total weight, what did you find out? Kilogram of tomatoes or weight of tomatoes. What we do from the total weight of vegetables, we have to subtract the weight of potatoes and onions this is the total weight of vegetables minus the sum of potatoes and onions we have to subtract okay this is the process what we have to do to find out the weight of tomatoes or kilogram of tomatoes okay this one first all our fraction, what we have to do? We have to convert them into improper fraction. Then see whether the denominators are same. Otherwise, find the LCM and continue all the process of sub addition and subtraction of fractions. Okay? You can see here 7 1 by 5 kg of top vegetables is the total weight. Then you have to write the statement weight of vegetables or kilogram of vegetables is equal to 7 1 by 5 kg. Then next statement weight of potatoes that is 2 3 by 8 kg. Next is weight of onions 3 1 by 4 kg. Therefore, therefore weight of tomatoes or kilogram of tomatoes is equal to total weight of vegetables minus in the bracket weight of potatoes plus weight of onions. Okay? Now, the last question that is a very easy question. We can see here in a thousand meter race, Aman took three one by five minutes while Amandeep took only two seven by ten minutes. Who took more time and how much more? You can see the time Amen took to reach. It's a thousand meter race. Who reaches the finishing point with the less time will be the winner. Okay. Now you can see Amen took 3 1 by 5 minutes. 3 1 by 5 minutes. And Amen did took 2 7 by 10 minutes. 2, 7 by 10 minutes. Okay. It means who is the winner here? Who took less time to reach Amanti? Now your question is, your question is, who took more time? Who took more time? What do you to compare? Whole number compare, but as easily we can find out. Here the whole number is 3, here the whole number is 2. Who took more time? Aman took more time. Now, how much more time to find out how much more time what we have to do? We have to find out the difference of time they took. Difference of time they took. For finding the difference what to do? 3 1 by 5 minus 2 7 by 10. When you do this full process, you will get how much time more Amen deep, sorry, Amen took. Okay, hope all of you understood.